Welcome to Radio Friends on Wednesday, August the 23rd. I've got Jane Whiteside to my right Morning, side. Paul. Jane Whiteside to my right side. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Not that good, Paul. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Missouri Symphony Society. What are we talking about today? Well, we're just getting ready for conservatory auditions on August 26th. So mm -hmm. if you have someone who wants to audition to be in one of our two youth orchestras, um, you need to contact our brand new conservatory coordinator, whose name is Mary Russell, and you can reach her at our office, 573-875-0600. So you got two... We do. Youth orchestra. We have a junior symphonia, which are the younger children, and then we have our um, junior artist uh, philharmonic, which are the older, mostly high school kids who've been playing with us for a while. They're the mm -hmm. more accomplished players. So what do they have to do to audition? They need to prepare a piece and uh, bring it to Broadway Christian Church. They need to sign up first because it's easier if we know how many kids are coming. Okay, so how do you sign and, up? And uh, you call Mary Russell at 875-0600. Okay. And she'll set you up an appointment. So then, then you audition, mm -hmm. and does everybody that auditioned, are they going to get a part? Or pretty much. You... Pretty, I don't think we've ever turned anyone away, okay. truthfully. Okay. I mean, it's an audition to find out where you're best going to fit. Like if you need to start with a junior symphonia, even let's say if you're in the eighth grade where you might be moving up, you might start with the Junior Symphonia because you're just not as experienced a player. Mm -hmm. So this is a way to sort of place the children where they're best going to perform. Right. So if they sign up to audition, chances are pretty good that they're going to get a yes. part. Yes. Yes. Then let's say they get the part. How often do they come to rehearse? Well, then they'll register, you know, to be part of the conservatory. Our first rehearsal, I think, is August 28th, and we rehearse at Broadway Christian Church every Monday night. Mm -hmm. So um, the younger kids rehearse first, and then the older kids rehearse after. So I think they How start at like 530. It's about maybe hour and 15 minutes for the younger children. I think it's a little longer for the older ones. Okay. And they work directly with Kirk. Is Kirk uh, Trevor, who is our maestro, is the director of the conservatory. We have an assistant conductor, Brianna Frieda, and then we have some coaches who work with the kids. Like there's a horn coach and there's a string coach, and yeah. you know. So it's a wonderful learning experience. It's a great. It is a great program. Is there a cost? Yes, there is. There is a tuition. We do have scholarships um, to can be applied um, for anybody who needs assistance. And we also have family discounts for people who have more than one child. Or if you're playing in an ensemble and playing in, in the orchestra, there are discounts involved with okay, that too. Okay, so when you call that number, which is? 875-0600. 875-0600 yeah. with operators standing by yeah. right now. <laughs> That's right. Call, yeah. <laughs> When you call that number, uh, you can get all the information about what it's going to cost, about any discounts that yes. would be available. And you can go to our website, mosymphony.org, which also, mosymphonysociety.org, pardon me, which has um, all the information. Also, you can register online. You can sign up to audition online. Uh, it's all right there. Okay. All right, Jane Whiteside, sitting at my right side. Uh, is there anything else you want to add? We're about out of time. Um, no, but be watching for our fall concerts because they'll be coming up. Okay. Are we going to talk about them on here? Yeah, I hope so. And right. our fall membership drive, which begins next month. And if you're not a member, we would like you to be one. All right. Jane Whiteside, thank you so thank much you. for coming by. Missouri Symphony Society. Thank it's you. always a pleasure to have you here. And she knows that number off the top of her head. 875-0600. 600. Got it. Now we're going to talk about From Freezer to Table. That is the name of a new cookbook. And this really is a... A beautiful book that I'm Thank holding you. in my hand. I want to introduce you to Rachel T. Meyer hey. and Polly Connor. It's hey, a pleasure hello. to have both of you ladies Thanks here. Thanks for having and us. And you both written the book? We did. We did. Yeah, Polly and I have been freezer cooking uh, just we even call ourselves, this is funny, freezer cooking evangelists. Like, we love freezer cooking. <laughs> freezer cooking evangelists. I like that. We will convert you. <laughs> you? Um, Actually, I grew up with freezer you cooking did. with we my mother. We were just chatting yeah. about that. He, he does not be, need to be converted. But um, the point is, our, we've written this book. We've been blogging about freezer cooking for years. And well, then, okay, well, what is freezer cooking? Yes, Can, let's explain back to them. Up. What let's is freezer up. cooking? That's a great question. Freezer cooking is very simple. It's freezing it's preparing meals ahead of time that are freezer friendly freezing them and having them on hand when you're ready to excuse me to make them mm -hmm. and so our book teaches you how to do that um, we've got 75 plus whole foods easy freezer meals that families can make yeah and, and you know and the pictures in here yeah. are 
gorgeous. Thank you. Absolutely. Pork and turkey. I'm looking. Yeah. At, I've got. I'm looking at foolproof roast right. pork tenderloin. We've got a photo of most of the recipes in there. Okay. Now, are you saying that you you prepare the pork tenderloin? It's all cooked. No. So most of these meals, you you were doing the prep work. You're going to freeze it, and then you will thaw it before you're ready to cook it. So and it comes out fresh. I mean, these yeah. meals taste. So you've just done like a everything meal. like this with the foolproof pork loin. You've Got it all prepped. Yes. With mm -hmm. the seasoning. Yes. Everything. That's Correct. what makes it so easy. There are so many benefits to freezer cooking that a lot of people don't know. So one, it saves a ton of time because you're prepping yeah. meals in bulk ahead of time, right? So mm -hmm. all you have to do is pop this pre-made ready re meal in the oven or however it's supposed to be cooked. You can also save a lot of money because you're buying in bulk. You're not eating out as much. You save a lot of stress. Like for young moms, mm -hmm. we have kids running around at dinner time or activities at night, and so there's a lot going on at dinner time. Right. So Having right. something you can pull straight that's been thawed out from the freezer into the oven is awesome. You know, the thing that I like to do, which my mother used to do, she would, when she would make uh, something, make item, you make, like you were saying, yes, a whole lot bulk, more. Multiple right. portions. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And then, but it would, a lot of times it would already be cooked. Okay. And you put it in the freezer and take it out, uh -huh. like stew uh -huh. or tomato sauce or chili. I still right. do that with chili. Yes, yeah, it's a I'll, great I'll thing make, to do that. Yeah, make mm -hmm. great big pots of chili yeah. at it one time. Yeah. And then put it in the freezer. We have recipes in, that have different cooking methods. So some are like that. You make ahead, so all you have to do is warm it up. Some are just assembled like we talk about. Mm -hmm. um, some go straight from the freezer to the oven. Yeah. Like we have some Parmesan chicken tenders, which are delicious. Oh, yeah. But those are great. I love those as a Sunday yeah. okay. afternoon. Okay, and uh, how many recipes are in here? So over 75. And, and like I said, we help you learn how to make freezer cooking a lifestyle. That's really been transforming for our own families. So where can they get this book? They can get the book at fromfreezertotable.com. So you go to from from freezer to table .com. Yeah. If you pre-order now, you get lots of goodies and bonuses as just some gifts for pre-ordering as a thank you. Okay. But it comes out September 12th in all major bookstores and sellers and um, locally in hy And, and it'll be on Amazon too? Mm -hmm. Amazon, yep. yep. Okay, so look for it. It's called From Freezer to Table. It It's really a beautiful book, and it sounds like what you have in here is fantastic. Yeah, thanks. thanks. We're excited See, to get you it You ladies have put hands. a lot. I keep coming back here to the zesty marinated <laughs> shrimp. I don't know You're why hungry, it opens right? to that page. <laughs> it's making me so hungry for shrimp tonight. Awesome. <laughs> All right? It's, From freezer to table. Job. Ladies, thank you so much for coming by. I, I hope you sell a ton of uh, books here. Me too. Right. Appreciate it. Pleasure Appreciate meeting you time. both. Thank okay? you for having Out of time us. for today, drop me an email, pepperp, missouri.edu.